Hey believers, this video is all about how can we get free 4K FC points. Furthermore, all these topics are covered throughout this video. 1. Get maximum rewards from Centurions events like 95, 96, or 97 rating players. 2. How to get 10x more scout points. 3. Get free 4K FC points and tips for both P2W and F2P players. Overall, this is going to be the best ever Centurions event guides. So believers, make sure you have subscribed to the channel for more amazing content just like this. Now, let's move to point number one. Get maximum rewards from Centurions events like 95, 96, or 97 rating players. Here, we will know how to get every possible reward from Centurion events and utilize them with maximum benefits. First, let's move to the Centurions event. First, this event is going to run for 29 days. Now let's go to the event and see what is special about the event. This event has a total of five chapters. First, let's see what is in the main chapter. First, you can see the Star Pass and if we go to the Star Pass, purchasing the pass, we are going to get a free 95 rating Zabi. But as a free reward, we will get all these similar things that we use to get in the other events. Now we need a Centurion's Pass credits to level up the pass. So for getting more passes and getting these rewards in time, I will tell you more tips. Now here you can see two players who are Zico and Van Nistelrooy. So the Zico stats are better than the Van Nistelrooy. Zico has 5 star foot and his both stamina. And skill move is great but in the case of the Van Nistelrooy. His stamina is not that great, and even the skill move is only 3 stars being a wing player. Also his weak foot is not good. So this card is useless, and I am selecting Zico. After you select one of the players, the parallel world chapter will be unlocked, and there are a total of 3 types of points in this chapter. First one is speed traits points, second one is passing traits points, and the third one is shooting traits points. Watching daily ads for 3 times you can get 9 traits points, and we will know what's the use of all the points. These traits points are not the different points, but out of three types of points, we can get any type of points if the traits points are mentioned in the reward. If we watch ads, now you can complete some of the training and matches to claim traits progress, which is going to be useful for getting the 100 traits points daily. From those matches, you can get daily 100 traits progress playing these four training and matches only. Once we reach daily 100 traits progress, we can claim these 100 traits points. Now, in this road to Zico section, we will get the option to exchange all the three types of traits points. We need two passing or shooting traits points to get one speed traits points and the similar things for exchanging passing and shooting traits points. Now you can get three versions of Zico. First version is speed, which has better speed. To get this Zico, we need to purchase this speed store for five times, which takes 500 speed traits tokens and 100 for opening each time. We can get 10 to 100 gems for opening the reward. Now after we open the store five times, this Zico will unlock. We will get two more versions of Zico, and the process is the same for them. We need to open the store five times and the rewards are a bit different for opening a store pack. Also, the passing version of Zico has better passing and the shooting version has better shooting. Since EA hasn't mentioned anything like you can choose only one version of Zico, we might be able to choose all three version of Zico. My suggestion would be, you collect the best version you like. I am going to open the speed version store pack to get speedy Zico then, only I will open the other store pack. Now, after 6 days you can unlock the road to growth chapter, and after 14 days another to be Centurion's chapter will be unlocked. Here. Find Centurion's chapter is already unlocked and let's see what's special here. Mainly you can find scout points in this chapter. First make sure to watch these ads 3 times daily to get 9 scout points. You can get 100 more scout points doing this exchange pack, which needs 3x80 plus rating players and 8x70 plus rating players. You can do this exchange pack as scout points are really essential to get 95, 96 or even 97 rating players. Now playing these modes you can claim the scout points. Progress. The head-to-head -head gives more scout progress points than other matches. Anyway, you just have to collect 100 scout progress daily, and then, after we collect 100 progress, we will get 100 free scout points. Now here you can see scout travel and this is a dice kind of game. This is the starting point and if you move this dice from here and come back here again then, this is the completion of one lap. Now once that one lap is completed, you will get these gems. After completing the lap for the third time, you will be able to claim these 200k coins. Similarly here you can see 91 to 97 and 93 to 97 rating players also, and these have really high chances to give you players like 95, 96 and even 97 rating. This pack is similar to 93 to 97 heroes, and I have got 96 Kohler from the 93 to 97 heroes exchange pack. But here it's completely free, and this pack contains all these awesome players. Completing a lap for 14 times we can get free 1 million coins, and completing for 15 times will give a buy. 
free fixed 94 rating player. Now, here you can see a chess icon, and once you click on go, this chess will move this much step or this much number ahead. If I have 5 numbers then, the icon will reach here, and I can claim 88 to 97 rating players. And this pack is also going to give you 95, 96, or even 97 rating players sometimes. It's rare, but it can give you a bit of luck dependent. And one more thing, if the chess icon goes in this 88 to 97 pack, then you can claim this pack plus once we complete. The laps for 4 times you can claim 88 to 97 pack for free. Completing laps for 8 times you can claim one more 88 to 97 pack. That's the complete workflow of how this lap works. Now, let's go to point number 2, where we will know to get 10x more scout points. To get more scout points and the Centurion's Pass credits come to the quest section, and you can see the Centurion's Quest. These quests can give you 700 scout points completing all these quest missions including other rewards. Also, once you complete all missions, you can claim this free 300 more scout points along with Mascarano and Centurion's Ultra Pack. In the exchanges section, you can get one scout point using five heroes tokens, and the limit is 150, so you can get 150 more scout points. Also, you can exchange 150 more scout points using 150 star pass points. You can get these pass points by completing the mission of the star pass. Also, to complete star pass, you need pass credits. To get more pass credits, I suggest you complete Complete the daily and weekly quest. Play more division rivals matches, and you can easily complete all levels before 5 to 10 days of the event ends. Now make sure you have saved the competitive points as in the next Tuesday, April 11th update, the rewards for this division rivals will be changed, and we can get a lot of good players that time. So save competitive points and the season will also end soon. So reach legendary to FC champion rank in VSA, head to head and manager mode to get more competitive, or advance competitive points. Now let's move to point number 3, get free 4k FC points and tips for both P2W and F2P players, so we can get 4k FC points for completely free. So recently you can see the FC points offers in the store section, and this is going to be the best time to buy the FC points because you are getting 4k FC points for free, and you have to buy 1k FC points to get it. By listening to this F2P player might exit the video, but you will miss a very important thing, so just be patient and stay for one to two minutes more. Mostly the 1k FC points needs 12.92 dollar, but if you buy this Centurion's funds in 12.92 dollar, then we will get 1k FC points for buying, and the extra 4k FC points is also free. This is really rare in FC Mobile. You will not get all 4k FC points in a day, but after you purchase this Centurion's funds pack, you have to log in for a total of 14 days to get 4k FC points. You can go to the quest section, and on the first day you will get 500 FC points. You you don't need to do anything, just log into the game and claim FC points. Similarly, after log into your account for this many days, you will keep on getting 500 FC points, and that will be a total of 4k FC points on the 14th day. Now you might ask me, is it really worth it or a scam? This is totally dependent on you. If you have bought a lot of FC points in the old days and still, if you have enough money or are rich to do the top up, then, this is the perfect time for you to buy this pack, and get 5k FC points where 4k FC points are for free. But before buying, understand what I am saying. I know well 95 to 98% of you are free to play users, and most of you might be from lower or middle class families, and for that you really don't need to buy FC points because there is one secret thing I want to say to you which is actually 100k FC points worthy. Once you buy 4k FC points, you will surely use it for store packs, right? And do you know, there are no such surely profitable store packs which can give you even 92 plus tradable players. So it's completely useless to do a top-ups. EA sold FC points in real currency where FC points is virtual currency. So why are you wasting your money for the virtual currency which doesn't even guarantee 92 rating plus players? Being a F2P player, I can buy players as of my choice in the market. Like I do already have around 1 billion plus coins in my account and if I want to buy Messi or any other players then, I can easily buy as of my choice but by paying money also, why are they still giving luck based rewards or you have to gamble? That's the reason FC points are just useless. If you waste 100k FC points also then, you will hardly get 3 to 597 rating players, but if you follow my investment tips, then you can literally earn as much as coins you want and buy whatever you want. Like with the 1 billion coins I can buy 5 to 897 rating players if I want, and that's with my choice. You just need good patience to learn investment, and this 0 to 100 over F2P series is perfect for you. There are a lot of my subscribers who are already in the 2 billion coins mark, and they can literally buy anyone they want. So don't waste your parents' earned money in this game because the players you want now trends will end within just 1 to 2 months.
You can even follow my gems trick to earn more gems and use your gems for free to open the store pack. But you need a bit of time for getting gems, and with the gems also, Ia will end up giving almost nothing if you don't use it in a worthy pack. Hope you are getting what I want to say. Just follow the investment tips as you will be good in market stuff also, and buy what you want. Now, if you are lazy, and just there to destroy your parents' hard-earned money in these useless packs, keep wasting your money and one day accept regression, you will get nothing where the F2P players who are following investments and earning coins will just get players of their choice. So yeah, my believers bros, that's it for today's video, and make sure to subscribe to the channel for more like this. I will meet you with the next one. Till then, your lovely host, Mr. Believer, signing out.